Africa, a continent of awe-inspiring landscapes, diverse cultures and rich history, has long been the cradle of human civilization. Beyond its captivating beauty, Africa has unveiled a treasure trove of scientific discoveries that have revolutionized our understanding of the world. From the depths of its oceans to the heart of its ancient lands, these extraordinary findings have changed the course of scientific inquiry and challenged preconceived notions. Today, we delve into some of the most remarkable scientific breakthroughs in Africa, each one transforming our perception of this captivating continent and its invaluable contributions to humanity. Venturing to the Red Sea off the coast of Egypt, scientists uncovered the diving blue hole. An underwater sinkhole shrouded in mystery. The blue hole's mesmerizing depths extend to over 300 feet, captivating divers and scientists alike with its breathtaking beauty and untold secrets. In 1997, an exploration team led by renowned marine biologist Dr. John Giddings descended into the depths of the diving blue hole. Their expedition revealed an astonishing array of ancient coral reefs preserved in pristine condition. These reefs, some dating back thousands of years, acted as a living archive of Earth's climate history. The intricate layers of coral provided vital clues about past environmental conditions and fluctuations in sea levels. By studying the coral's growth patterns, scientists could reconstruct a detailed timeline of climate changes in the region. The diving blue hole's submerged world offered an unparalleled perspective on our planet's past and the cyclical nature of climate change. The findings from the diving blue hole had significant implications for our understanding of climate change, providing tangible evidence of its cyclical nature. The ability to examine these ancient coral reefs offered critical insights into past climate shifts, giving scientists a broader context for the current environmental challenges we face. Namibia's dead trees in dead flay present a haunting sight with ancient camel thorn trees standing petrified amidst a vast salt pan. This poignant tableau serves as a stark reminder of the consequences of climate change and desertification in the region. The dead camel thorn trees, once thriving, now stand as eerie sentinels of environmental degradation. The Namib Desert's harsh climate and encroaching salt pans have caused the trees' demise, leaving behind a barren and otherworldly landscape. This stark transformation underscores the pressing challenges of climate change and its impact on fragile ecosystems. As the global climate crisis intensifies, the dead trees and dead flay offer a tangible glimpse of what lies ahead if decisive action is not taken. The haunting image serves as a poignant symbol, urging us to reflect on the urgency of adopting sustainable practices and mitigating the effects of climate change. Conservation efforts in the region focus on protecting the remaining camel thorn trees and restoring the ecosystem to its former glory. The study of these trees has provided valuable insights into the ecological processes of desertification, guiding scientists in developing strategies to combat its effects. One of the most significant discoveries emerges from the cradle of humankind in South Africa, Homo nalendi. In 2013, paleontologists led by Lee Berger unearthed fossils of this ancient hominin species in the Rising Star Cave system. The revelation of Homo nalendi presented an entirely new chapter in our evolutionary history. The coexistence of primitive and modern traits in this species challenged existing models of human evolution, leading to intense debates within the scientific community. The fossils found in the Rising Star Cave system painted a vivid picture of Homo nalendi's anatomy and behavior. With a unique blend of ape-like and human-like features, this discovery shed new light on the complexities of human development and diversified the hominin evolutionary tree. The findings suggest that Homo nalendi had burial rituals signifying a level of symbolic behavior previously attributed only to modern humans. The implications of Homo nalendi's discovery were far-reaching, questioning the prevailing notion of a linear human evolutionary progression. The discovery emphasizes the mosaic nature of our ancestry, with various hominin species coexisting and intermingling throughout history. Homo nalendi's presence deep within the African continent reinforced Africa's status as the birthplace of humanity and strengthened the continent's pivotal role in our collective evolutionary story. In the heart
heart of East Africa, the Great Rift Valley stretches across multiple African countries, revealing a grand geological spectacle. This immense trench, stretching over 3,700 miles from Mozambique to Syria, offers an unprecedented glimpse into Earth's ancient tectonic processes and the forces that shaped our continents. The Great Rift Valley is a result of tectonic plate movements as the African and Arabian plates gradually drift apart. Over millions of years, the Earth's crust has slowly stretched and fractured, creating a series of interconnected fault lines and volcanoes along the valley's length. The geology of the Rift Valley is a tapestry of diverse landscapes, ranging from active volcanoes to vast savannas and stunning freshwater lakes. The valley houses some of Africa's most iconic biodiverse habitats supporting a rich variety of plant and animal life. Scientists have relied on the Rift Valley's geological features to gain profound insights into the dynamic processes that have shaped our planet. By studying the valley's seismic activity and geological formations, researchers can better understand the mechanics of plate tectonics and how continents evolve over geological timescales. The Rift Valley also holds significant archaeological and paleontological importance. The region has yielded fossils of ancient hominins, providing critical evidence for the evolution of early human ancestors. These findings reinforce Africa's standing as the cradle of humanity and highlights the region's indispensable role in understanding our shared evolutionary heritage. In Mauritania, there lies the enigmatic Eye of the Sahara, also known as the Rashat Structure. This vast circular geological formation has puzzled scientists for generations, leading to various theories about its origin and formation. The Eye of the Sahara spans an area of nearly 30 miles in diameter and stands as one of the most prominent geological anomalies on Earth. Its distinctive circular shape, visible from space, has sparked numerous speculations about its origin, ranging from an ancient impact crater to a geological dome created by volcanic processes. Despite its striking appearance, the Eye of the Sahara is not the result of a cosmic impact event, but rather an uplifted and eroded dome of layered sedimentary rock. Geological processes such as erosion and uplift have carved out this captivating feature over millions of years, exposing the geological layers beneath the surface. The discovery and study of the Eye of the Sahara have had far-reaching implications for the understanding of Earth's geological history. The structure's distinctive concentric rings provide a natural laboratory for studying geology and the processes that shape terrestrial landforms. As scientific exploration continues, the Eye of the Sahara remains a focal point for researchers seeking to unlock its geological mysteries. Its unique and captivating form will undoubtedly inspire future generations of geologists and Earth scientists to delve deeper into the enigmatic wonders of our planet. South Africa boasts its own version of Stonehenge, the Stonehenge of Africa, an ancient stone circle believed to align with celestial events. This exceptional astronomical alignment stands as a testament to the early African civilization's profound knowledge of the cosmos and their cultural practices tied to celestial observations. The Stonehenge of Africa, also known as Adam's Calendar, is situated on the slopes of the Mpumalanga province's mountains. It consists of a circular arrangement of standing stones that align with the sunrise during the solstices and equinoxes. The site's precise astronomical alignments demonstrate a sophisticated understanding of celestial events and the solar calendar. The structure is estimated to be around 75,000 years old, making it one of the oldest known stone structures in the world. The astronomical alignments found at the Stonehenge of Africa offer profound insights into the sophisticated knowledge and spiritual beliefs of early African civilizations. The precise alignment of the stones with celestial events such as the solstices and equinoxes reveal an intricate understanding of the movement of the sun and the stars. These astronomical alignments would have played a vital role in the daily lives of the ancient inhabitants, guiding their agricultural practices, religious ceremonies and cultural celebrations. The significance of the Stonehenge of Africa extends beyond the continent, resonating with researchers, astronomers and enthusiasts worldwide. Its exceptional astronomical precision challenges conventional perceptions of ancient cultures, highlighting Africa's contribution to the development of astronomy and advanced knowledge of the cosmos.
The study of early prehistory remains in Zimbabwe contributes significantly to our understanding of the region's rich cultural heritage and the complex history of human development. The diverse artifacts found in these archaeological sites offer glimpses into the daily lives, social structures and religious beliefs of ancient African civilizations. In addition to the Great Zimbabwe Ruins, other significant archaeological sites in Zimbabwe include Kami, Tlotlo and Nalatali. Each site provides unique insights into the cultural diversity and technological achievements of early inhabitants. The stone ruins of Zimbabwe represent a sophisticated urban civilization that thrived long before the arrival of European colonizers. The intricate stonework, extensive trade networks and agricultural practices demonstrate the complexity and resilience of these ancient societies. Archaeologists and historians continue to explore these sites, meticulously piecing together the puzzle of Zimbabwe's ancient past. The findings contribute to a broader narrative of Africa's contributions to global history and challenge long-held misconceptions about the continent's historical significance. Ghana's captivating tradition of fantasy coffins showcases an exquisite display of artistic brilliance and cultural heritage. These elaborately designed coffins celebrate the lives and passions of the deceased, reflecting the region's cultural diversity and the belief in an afterlife. The tradition of fantasy coffins began in the coastal region of Ghana, particularly in the city of Teshi. In the mid-20th century, carpenter Seth Kane Kwe revolutionized coffin design by creating personalized and whimsical coffins that represent the deceased's profession, interests or aspirations. Fantasy coffins come in various shapes and sizes, ranging from animals and vehicles to everyday objects and symbols. For example, a fisherman may be laid to rest in a coffin shaped like a boat, while a teacher might have a coffin resembling a book or an apple. These custom-made coffins celebrate the life of the deceased and serve as a reflection of their contributions and achievements. The artistic brilliance of fantasy coffins has garnered international attention, earning recognition as an exceptional form of African art. Art enthusiasts and collectors from around the world seek these unique coffins as prized cultural artifacts, highlighting their value as both funerary art and a testament to Ghana's vibrant artistic traditions. As we venture deeper into the heart of Zimbabwe, we are transported back in time to an era when giants ruled the land. The rugged landscapes that characterize this region have yielded a remarkable treasure trove, the fossilized remains of dinosaurs that once roamed these very lands. These ancient relics offer a direct link to a prehistoric world, a world dominated by colossal reptiles that have long since vanished. The dinosaur fossils discovered in Zimbabwe provide invaluable insights into the biodiversity and ecosystems that flourished millions of years ago. The painstaking work of paleontologists has unearthed evidence of various species, from massive herbivores like the long-necked sauropods to fearsome predators like the megaraptor. By studying these fossils, scientists can piece together the puzzle of these ancient creatures' lives, habits and interactions, offering a window into the intricate tapestry of life on Earth during the Mesozoic era. These discoveries not only fuel our fascination with the giants of the past, but also shed light on the dynamic processes that have shaped our planet's history. The study of dinosaur fossils in Zimbabwe contributes to the broader field of paleontology, aiding in our understanding of evolutionary patterns, climate changes and the geological shifts that have molded our world. By peering into this ancient chapter of Earth's history, Zimbabwe's dinosaur discoveries provide a tangible connection to the distant past, enriching our appreciation of the ever-evolving narrative of life on our planet. Amidst the lush rainforests and serene wetlands of Africa, a true wonder of the amphibian world resides the African Goliath frogs. These astonishing creatures, renowned for their enormous size, embody the incredible biodiversity that flourishes within Africa's vibrant ecosystems. The Goliath frogs are more than just a testament to nature's diversity. They offer a glimpse into the delicate balance that sustains life within the continent's rich and varied habitats. Found in parts of Central and West Africa, Goliath frogs captivate the imagination with their extraordinary proportions. With some reaching lengths of over a foot and weighing several pounds, these frogs are a living testament to the marvels of adaptation and evolution. 
The large size is believed to be an adaption to their environment, allowing them to thrive in the fast-flowing rivers and streams that characterize their habitats. The presence of African goliath frogs within the continent's ecosystems highlights the intricate web of life that spans from the smallest microorganisms to the most imposing creatures. These frogs play a crucial role in maintaining ecological balance, contributing to insect control and nutrient cycling within their habitats. Their unique behaviors such as vocalizations and mating rituals also offer insights into the complex interactions that shape the natural world. Moreover, the conservation of African goliath frogs underscores the importance of protecting Africa's diverse ecosystems. As flagship species, these frogs draw attention to the urgent need for habitat preservation and sustainable practices that safeguard not only their survival, but also the well-being of countless other species that call Africa home. In the realm of scientific exploration, Africa's astonishing discoveries resonate as more than just marvels of the continent. They stand as profound revelations that ripple through the global tapestry of knowledge. From ancient hominids that illuminate the origins of humanity to underwater enigmas and geological wonders that bridge past and present, these revelations are not confined by borders. They transcend continents, leaving an incredible mark on our understanding of the world. These scientific revelations hold a mirror to humanity, reflecting our shared history, aspirations, and the unending pursuit of understanding.